Rock County Communications. When you call 911 in Rock County, where's the emergency? This is who might be on the other line. This is Kathy from the dispatch center. For over a decade, Kathy Helgeson has been answering calls here. It's always different because you never know when you pick up the phone what it's going to be. She has to think quick. So you just try to get as much information as you can and ask the right questions. Where is she bleeding from? To paint a picture for first responders. We need to know what type of help you need before just to help speed things along. But soon, the way she takes in that information, what's your phone number? Could make the process go even faster. Well, the current system we have now is um, based on 1960s technology, so basically copper phone lines. In the 20 um, plus years Kathy Sukas, the communications director, has worked here, she's seen few changes to their system. Overall, it's been very durable and done its job, but. You know, with the emerging technology, there's not much more they can do with it. That's why the state is overhauling 911 call centers. And county communications. Putting them on a digital platform, allowing them to work better with mobile technology. 80% of our calls are from 911 calls, that is, um, that we receive are from cellular phones. It's called Next Generation 911. Switching to digital would allow 911 centers to locate callers more accurately, transfer calls to other departments faster, and even allow dispatchers like Kathy to receive pictures or videos. It would be very helpful, I think, in cases of fires or just to get an idea of some things. I think it's good for the community to be able to call from any device, anywhere, anytime. And help dispatch centers around the state get you the help you need. A lot of days you don't know how much you're actually doing that, but then you'll get the one call where it really did help. In Janesville, Hannah Flood, NBC 15 News.